What was it called? The Roosevelt Depository? Yeah, the Roosevelt Depository. Yeah, we're heading over there right now. But we're cutting through Church Street. And we have a lot of beautiful buildings that I kind of... Yeah. Everything's older style. Colonial, isn't it what it's called? Yeah, I think this one is with their older style. What does it say right there? Cork Town. Part of Detroit. Crossing the street. <laughs> yeah. We're a bunch of amateur urban explorers. We're just starting out at this. Yeah. This is not really urban exploring though, this is just walking down the street. To to the area. Uh where does this say right here? Oh yeah. We're gonna go this is Rosa Park Boulevard. That everyone didn't know. Where are we coming? It's gonna be right there. station, I believe, and then Henry Ford said uh, Henry Ford's grandson was gonna, like, you know, use it as a symbol of the rejuvenation of Detroit, and yeah, I saw a drone video a while back, though, it was pretty cool on the inside. They, re they redid some uh, particular sections, like I think the facade of it. It's her dog. <laughs> and we did the facade to the outside, so it would look nice. We're slowly starting it. Yeah. You don't have to worry about it, We're not breaking any rules. So this is the Roosevelt Depository. Yeah, okay. <laughs> not getting into it. Yeah. <laughs> Looks, looks like someone tried to break the top lock on it. <laughs> this is what it is. Just get a nice view from top to bottom. <laughs> so this apparently used to be a post office and they converted it over into a school right. depository. So all the books and stuff went in here. But then it, bur it burnt down and people were exploring it. I don't know the exact year. Let me just put that in later. Yeah, we'll put the year in there. What's, what do you say? Oh, what's over here? So you punch, this is what you do. <laughs> yeah, I can't do it from there. Yeah, <laughs> you think you're gonna get in from there? No, you can literally get in here from here. <laughs> let's, let's go look around first, but look at that. There's no flash. Yeah, there was a window that was broken. Like people have already been down here. Fuck. This one's that one's open. That's the uh, old train station across the way. Look at people are. Uh, looks like looks like a. It's being restored. The motorcycle right there. You got a little park. This is a nice little little park. So we can walk. We can check this out first, Ponch, I guess, and then we can walk around the back. Want to do that, or do you want to check this out first fully? You can walk around the back. What's over here, though? Got some clothes over here. Lots of trash. It's just a door. This, like, they they put plywood up over everything. Can 
man. We can talk to that guy and see what's going on in this building. Well, let's keep going back further back. Yeah. I don't want to look like I'm suspicious. Be a U little UPS car. Take the video, but don't touch the property, okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, don't Apologize. touch the gates or anything, okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. You need to take the video. Yeah. It's private property, okay? All right. All right, thank you. You're welcome. You have a good day. You too. Yeah. <laughs> can't, uh, I can't touch the property. That's yeah, fine. It's fine, yeah. Yeah, I guess they really... So this is kind of what it is. No, we have half battery life left. So we're just gonna have to charge it when we go to McDonald's. This is the back side. I don't see, um, I don't think people really see what the back looks like. This is the mural. Oh, no zooming in. Follow the mural. It's kind of, kind of, I wanna say it's not as much psychedelic, it's like, because of all the hard lines. But it is a little psychedelic. Sure. Got an old church right there. It's probably still in use. Oh, okay, you can see the... Whole city. You wanna get in it, Podge? <laughs> That's Detroit. So I just wanted to get a quick video of entering back into downtown. We saw that skyline a little bit ago. There's Podge. <laughs> and this is me, Dallas. I'm a little awkward. Forgive me. <laughs> We're just living the life in Detroit. Probably, in my opinion, it's very misunderstood. Other ways, they're right. There's a lot of things that I, I like it. It has heart and childhood attachments because I was born in the area, even though I wasn't really born in Detroit itself. <laughs> <laughs> 